Avenue. Tonight, a group of more than 30 people rallied this afternoon in light of their gun rights. Open Carry Texas, a nonprofit organization dedicated to the safe and legal carry of firearms in the state, led its first rally here in Amarillo. ABC 7's Marissa Lucero joins us now with more. Marissa. Yeah, Selena, the group has held more than 2,300 rallies across Texas. Get this, they've only been a nonprofit for about two years. And like you said, this was their first time here in Amarillo. For the first time in history, I really wanted to be here for the first walk. Both an open carry bill and a campus carry bill have passed out of committee and now lie in the hands of the Senate. The biggest argument we face is people are going to be scared. Uh, that law enforcement and people aren't going to know the difference between a good guy and a bad guy. We have 44 test beds in this country because 44 states have open carry. So are Texans dumber, less intelligent, less capable of handling themselves than 44 other states? I doubt that. President and founder of Open Carry Texas, C.J. Grisham, held the organization's first rally in Amarillo to promote and educate others about their push for open carry. It shocks me that we are and that, you know, Oklahoma, just right over the border, I mean, they are so unrestrictive. I could walk in there and be less restricted than I am in my home state. The group says they're rallying in support of their gun rights. Shotguns, rifles can all be worn like this in the state of Texas. We are one of only six states that doesn't allow the open carry of a modern handgun. Yet small pistols and handguns have to go without being seen. If I were to pick up my jacket right now, I'd be an instant criminal, yet I'm still the same person. So we're trying to change that here in Texas. And the way to do that, Grisham says, is to rally in public and rally for representatives to create change. A lot of people are passionate about this. Even in this weather, people coming out, it's it's really awesome. It, it shows the passion everybody has and, and a commitment to the cause. The group says they do plan to hold more rallies in the near future here in Amarillo. From the Kennedy Broadcast Center, I'm Marissa Lucero, ABC 7 News.